welcome back to my channel hope you guys enjoy this story time makeup video and if you guys are new to this channel subscribe down below and also comment and also like this video if you guys want more tea video story time with me with jackie super size fibers it's just a way to lift my brows that is all it is and i just do it on the inner corner right here i'm gonna use a little bit of the cover girl and then we're gonna go ahead and start from the bottom it's prom in junior year <clears throat> okay you guys grab your chips because this is gonna get good this is gonna get juicy this is gonna get interesting this is one guy of course a guy <laughs> but wait <laughs> it gets interesting there was this one guy that i liked in my junior year but i like the guy and this is not right he would sit in front of the class like you know on the right side i was on the back i think i have a picture still i, I have not deleted all my pictures from like you know when i was a teenager but here we are he he would sit like on the right i will be in the back i was like very shy like i didn't really talk during the class i just i was just there i just wanted to learn just wanted to test get in get out i don't want to talk i followed him on instagram and i don't i think he accepted quest i think he did and because his instagram was private well i don't even know if he followed me i don't i don't remember my request and he accepted it just my friends and i would just be very quiet about it or they're just like oh my goodness look who's over there this man blah blah, blah. i'm like oh yes i know he's over there blah blah they're like oh my goodness should you go talk to him and i'm like mm, mm, no thank you <laughs> that, no i didn't really want to get rejected that's the reason why i didn't go and talk to him this night i really like this guy and i really wanted to ask him or i want him to ask me to prom and one day decided to do a post i knew that he liked video games and it was something like this if i can find i'll put it right here i got the i got the poster that one day i got all the stuff together i did not even sleep <laughs> more like that night so we did this big poster for him cds i was like so I'm, I'm very like creative when it comes to like crafting very i'm extra this big poster for that one dude that i regret even making it but here we are talking about it so it makes a good story to look back and like that's just dumb but ask that guy i should ask someone else you know my friends all together and everything and i'm like hey i really want to ask this guy but i don't know what he's gonna say before i even get to that what happened was he had a best friend that best friend let's just say his name was bob but it's not bob <laughs> bob i texted him because he they were best friends his best friend was in my spanish class so i texted bob and i was like hey i just want to ask you like hey is so so person going to prom the guy that I like I never had done that or even asked him his best friend if the guy that i was you know had a crush on if he was gonna go to prom because that was a red flag right there his best friend i should have known he was a big mouth and he i'm pretty sure told the guy that i liked that i was asking if he was gonna go to prom because i was gonna ask him to prom i don't know if i have a message post it right here Good and good. I didn't apply blue lash. I'm gonna go ahead and Maybelline fit me. A big mistake that I did. I should have never, ever asked if he was going to prom because he already knew. From the start, from the day that I texted his best friend, he already knew that I liked him. <laughs> I was like, don't meet me. Those teenagers out there. Don't be asking their best friend, the your crush best friend, if so so person's gonna be at the party. It's just a waste of my time. And it was, it was a waste of my freaking time. How was I thinking? I should have never done that. I should have just done that to someone that I, I was best friends with. That's just so sad. I could have just made their day. Me asking someone that I knew. I know Pernay, this is sad. <laughs> memory. It's a memory that you have for like teenage years and you know, someone that never got asked. I could have asked someone. Fly the and state how like <laughs> when i asked him you know his best friend about if he was going to go to prom i went to my math class and it was just very um, way very weird like it wasn't the same like m like i would just go and then he would just look at me i'm like this guy why are you looking at me why are you giving me those signs you know what i mean why are you giving me the signs that you like me or you just 
curious or some sort or you just want to talk to me i just don't know what it is but you know when they know they know and they just start looking at you more are you playing with my feelings or emotions and what the heck is going on with my brain right now personality just changed once he found out that something was up like turning around more where i you know where i was and not talk to me but you know the people that were around him like his friends in the back were like very close to him they were always talk but he will always turn around his body language would always like towards you know me i felt like this type of way i'm like oh my goodness Ooh, like what's going on i feel like it's we need an ac up in here like <laughs> you find out he was a jerk here we are i guess that's what i was attracted to do back then friends that um you know snapchat was very trendy like back then and then people would video i know from other you know people that you know they had classes with them and i found out from their snapchat because they would post and then randomly this the person i like it would be in the background or some sort i just wait they're in your class and maybe you're trying to get evidence <laughs> no like what class he had with what teacher he had the reason why is because i i had friends that had classes with him and they knew that i liked him and they were all gathered at my math class like in you know in the hallway they're like oh my goodness are you gonna do it come on like is he in there and then my friend like one of my friends she was like yes he's in there go and ask him and or someone call him and so he can go i'm over here I'm like, nah it's okay so then after i went inside my friends you know they left then after I text him like, hey, I'm gonna do this in math class. Well, in his Spanish class. And he had the same Spanish teacher as me, but mine would, would be like a different day. He found out. He knew that I was going, <laughs> he knew that I was gonna ask him that day when I was in my math class, because him and I had the same geometry, you know, teacher. When we got out of math class, I took the poster to my Spanish class teacher, and I told her, I'm like, hey, can I leave this here? Why am I whispering? Well, they had a poster aquí en su clase porque la mente voy a decir a alguien que sea mi. Ask this person, you know, to prom. She was like, she was like, who is it? This is not blah, blah, blah. I'm like, he's in your class. And she was like, what? Oh my goodness, I'm so happy. This and she was like so excited for me in this night, right? It's these colors right here. I left the poster there. I was gonna ask him, I had the guts to do it. <laughs> I don't know where I got the guts to do it, but here we are. Guys, girls, girls out there, when I ask a guy out, do it, do it, do it. Out of math, math class, you know, I was trying to look for it. Straight to my Spanish class because technically my Spanish class was close to my math class. It was downstairs. I went to go get the poster. I was, my friend, I told her to stay with me so then we can, you know, we could video and whatnot. But, so I went to my Spanish class to go get the poster. Well, I was about to get the poster. <clears throat> People were like, oh, what is that? What is that poster? Are you asking someone to prom? Of course, if you got a poster, someone's gonna say, oh, are you asking someone to prom? Because technically everyone is doing it. Everyone in the freaking school is doing it. And I've never asked someone to prom in my life. I did this poster just because I wanted to, because I like this guy. People are like, oh my goodness, who's the guy? Who's the lucky guy? I told them, I'm like, oh, why am I whispering again? <laughs> so I told them like, hey, I'm like, mm, I don't know if I should tell you, but he is in this, he is in your Spanish class. And all waiting for this freaking guy. The classroom now knew what I was doing. <laughs> and um, so I'm using this cute palette. It's Hello Beautiful Chella. You know, it would, I would put this one on. It's like a peachy nude color. And then now I'm doing this brown one on my, you know, side right here in the corner waiting outside his classroom they they went to go find him to know where he was and you know where he was grab your tips how did i go to school in my ju junior year and my senior year you know what i mean i was so nervous it's not my friends were like waiting for him then afterwards they left after that because it, it, it was taking him so long i'm like this guy 
come on where are you at but <laughs> he um one of the guys went to the bathroom to go look for him and they found him in the bathroom he knew what was going on he <laughs> He was hiding in the freaking bathroom. He said that he had like very bad, like something was going on, you know, you know, he like tenia churria, okay? Tenia churria. Here we are. Okay, that was not true. He was hiding from me. But why are you hiding in the bathroom the whole entire time? Come on, dude. Like get out of the toilet. <laughs> he told the guy that he didn't want to hurt my feelings. So when the guy came back, he told I think he told the teacher. He didn't want to tell me specifically in my face so he told the teacher teacher told me teacher comes out from the room and she's like i don't i don't think she said that i'm just adding that i was it's so funny porque no te quiere lastimar tus sentimientos por eso está en el baño escondido it's like, oh, okay. He doesn't want to hurt my feelings. It's because he was going to say no. The teacher to, you know, do a pass for me to go to class. My stuff, I got the poster that I never even showed him. I never showed the poster to him at all. My friends and all, they're like, oh my goodness, he was going to love that, blah, 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 this and that, right? I never showed it. I'm like, forget you. Like, what's the point, you know? And then, do this gold right here. I was heading to my class. I to go to my class in the other side of the you know, school. And then when I was walking, I hear this guy voice and he's like, it's like a name. Like he said, Jacqueline. He's like, Jack. He's like, Jacqueline. I said it twice. First time I heard him, I didn't want to look back. I was like, whatever. And then the second time, uh, he said it the second time and he said Jacqueline I'm like and then I turned around and he was like I was like yes I'm like what I don't even know if I said yes or what I don't even know what I said but I responded and I looked at him he looked at me like he was like can I speak to you can I talk to you I don't even know what he said and I was like sure I guess <laughs> I honestly don't remember what he said. It's all blurry to me right now. I know he feels this type of way about me. So sorry, but I don't feel that way about you. He, he said sorry to me. Then while he was talking, there was like a weird music in the back. And like, because band class was downstairs, I could hear them. And they just started playing their music. And I'm like, what is that noise? He was talking, talking, talking. And then I... I <laughs> I went to a different topic. I'm like, you, can you hear that noise? <laughs> and it was just so funny to me. I'm like, what the heck is wrong with me? I'm not, he was over here expressing himself. He's like, hey, I'm so sorry. I don't feel this type of way about you. I'm like, okay. I don't know if we hug or he hugged me. I don't even know what happened. And then I went back to my friend. I told him about it. He's like, hey, everything is okay. And I said, I'm like, I'm okay. Then I went to the bathroom and I was like, why am I upset? I'm like, I, I, I was about to cry, but I'm like, no, I should not cry about this. Um, and then I spoke to, I was like, you know, talking to God. I was like, hey, let's just start. Like, whatever, there's other boys out there. I was upset, mad, and this and that, but I was like, whatever. Brush it out. It's okay. Life keeps going. We're good. It, it's not the end of the world because I got rejected. So, life keeps going. And there's other fish in the sea. Like, in my senior year, I was getting my cup and gown and he saw me and he just looked at me and he couldn't stop looking at me. I don't, it was crazy. And yeah, I left and I saw him from the corner of my eye and I look very different. My eyebrows look so cute and everything. I got my hair done and everything. I look different as heck. And this is a photo right here. Okay, you guys, if you guys like that video, story time, makeup, and subscribe down below and also like this video and if you guys are new to this channel what are you guys waiting for go down below and like this video and more of these stories thank you guys for watching and see you guys in my next video